Good evening. Thank you for joining us. I'm Greg Glover. The number of coronavirus cases in our area rose slightly today. Hamilton County reported two more cases. That brings the total to 32. Bledsoe County and the city of Pikeville are the latest to declare states of emergency amid the spread of COVID-19. This will help provide funding to the areas and close non-essential businesses. The mayors made the announcement on a Facebook Live video this afternoon. Two cases of COVID-19 have been identified in Bledsoe County. Tonight, a closer look at what's happening inside a lab at the Baylor School, where coronavirus tests are being processed. Our Jake Chapman joins us in the studio now with the latest. Jake. Well, Greg, the first batch of tests arrived this afternoon from health care providers around Hamilton County. The headmaster for Baylor School tells us the idea came from two research scientists at the school who are ready to help. I know our scientists, Dr. Forster and Dr. Richards, are, um, are really excited to get started with this work. This is the first work of its kind in Hamilton County. Until now, the samples were sent out of town for processing. You know, we're ready to do it as long as, it, as the county needs us to do it. Baylor Headmaster Scott Wilson explains how it works. We have a courier that uh, goes from the health center to uh, our participating hospitals and ends up at Baylor with the samples. The samples are taken into the lab and we, um, we process, process them as fast as we can. Wilson says it takes four hours to do 24 tests, which will add up to around 65 tests daily with results in just 24 hours. So they, they'll work um, the equivalent of a, you know, a two shifts, I would guess, uh, to get today's, uh, today's work done. Um, they're, they're incredible scientists. Hamilton County health officials say this team effort funded by the county will be a key to stopping the spread. You know, this is a, hopefully a partnership that will benefit everybody in, in Hamilton County. Again, Baylor isn't an actual testing site. If you feel like you need to be tested, be sure to call your health care provider. Tomorrow, the health department will receive the results from Baylor, school, uh, Baylor School's 